Howdy, everybody. My name's Brandon, and welcome to day two of Veef. So for those of you who don't know, I'm attempting Veef, which means vlog every evening in February. Um, so that's a lot of videos to create, and I thought today I could take the time to show you some embarrassing things. Because after all, what's better than shaming yourself on the internet? So, uh, I'm gonna preface this by saying that I started out in college as a theater design tech major, which means I have to take a series of classes in both the technical side and the design side of theater. Uh, I only lasted a year in that school, in that major, um, but in that year I had to take a class where they made me do things that I could not do, aka draw and paint and things. So basically, uh, <laughs> I had to do all these pictures, right? I had, to, I had to paint and draw and things I can't do very well. And uh, I wanted to get rid of the pictures. My mother thought they were so cute um, and wanted to keep them. So she framed them and put them in this this thing. So there we go. Look at look at my attempt at a house. Look at look at the houses. Look at this. Do you see? I've got a purple house. I think I might have been on shrooms when I drew that. A, a purple house. It's Dr. Seuss. That's what that is. Um, <laughs> and look, I drew a lady this one time, or I painted, I don't know what that is, paint. But look, she doesn't have, there's no, her, her leg, look, where's her leg? Her leg, look, what, it's just, it's like, she's, look at these legs, look at this woman, look at her legs. Un unrealistic beauty standards for women. So I wanted to show you those for a couple of reasons. Number one, because I wanted to embarrass myself a little bit. Number two, because I wanted to embarrass my mom a little bit because I know she watches these videos. Um, and number three, to inspire you guys or to encourage you guys to do something that maybe you're not the best at. Um, you might not feel like you have the best skill set in something, whether it be drawing or painting, uh, but attempt it anyway. I think it's great to uh, push your boundaries, um, do things you're not necessarily comfortable with or good at. Um, I was not good at this, it did not make me happy, but if it makes you happy, um, try it, do it. Don't let people tell you that your doodles in class are not good, and don't let people tell you that your videos are terrible, or that your Tumblr is too hodgepodged, or that whatever, you know what, forget them, you don't need that. Do something that scares you, do something that inspires you, do something that you think is <laughs> not, you know, you might not be the greatest at it, but I promise it'll be an interesting exercise in creativity, it'll be an exercise in self-esteem and in humbleness, probably. So <laughs> draw something, write something, shoot something, do something, do something, that's what I'm gonna call this video, do something. Um, that you wouldn't normally do or that you don't feel like you're you're talented at because I've got faith in you That's it. It's not a long video um, I just wanted to encourage you guys to like step outside of your comfort zone. Do you hear that? Yeah, fat thighs. I mean, of course I'm clapping them slow Unrealistic beauty standards. So do something that encourages you do something that's outside of your comfort zone uh, Give it a go. You know who knows your mother may frame it and keep it forever and never let you forget that you're not a skilled drawler. Um, but you know what? Screw it. It was fun. The class was fun. I had fun drawing these things. So step outside your comfort zone. Do something crazy. Take up a new craft, a new trade. Do something artistic and express your creativity. That's all. Love you. See you tomorrow. Bye!